We're also thankful for some of the artists who came out to help us preview Juneteenth. Orville Brown, painter, illustrator, extraordinaire. Um, Art has always been in your system, but you said about 21, you said, you know what? I'm just going to go for it. Right, Orville? Yeah. All right. Tell us about the uh, mural you're going to paint. It's actually going to be a man draped in an American flag, right? Yeah. Why is that important to you? Um, I just think it's important to uh, remember your identity. Mm -hmm. Just uh, stand strong as Americans, you know, um, especially in this, uh, you know, in the midst of all the uh, confusion and chaos. Right. So you just wanted to show a positive message for the country. Absolutely. Like. Yeah. And that's important to you because you said uh, sometimes when you take away all the exterior stuff, <laughs> it's important to know who you are and what you stand for, right? Definitely. That is awesome. Well, Orville, all right, we're going to let you Keep going. Keep working, okay. man. That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, there's going to be several murals down here uh, for the Juneteenth uh, Festival. It starts tomorrow. Uh, as, as you can see, we have another artist back there starting. Uh, three stages this year, so it has gotten bigger. Three stages that will have music, dance, spoken word, or close to 70 different vendors. Uh, you name it, they have it. So it's definitely a party with the purpose, the celebration. That's what that means, Jim? Go on this side. Okay, Lacey, good morning. How are you? All right, so tell us about your mural that you are painting here. Keep painting, though. Yeah. So for my live painting, mm -hmm. I really wanted to focus on the unity of black women. Okay. As well as the beauty and versatility of our hair. Okay. Yeah. So right now, all of your black women look like my hair. Because ah! I barely have any left. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, so while you're painting, why was that your message? Why is that important to you? Um, so that's important to me because growing up, it's great to see representation of positive black women loving each other, supporting mm -hmm. each other. Mm -hmm. And as an artist, I feel like it's my duty to illustrate that, okay. you know? Excellent. Now, you have a show coming up, don't you? I do. You look how excited you are. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get paid. Yay. <laughs> so, it'll be my first solo show in October. Congratulations. Thank you. And it will be at the current Cleveland on the west side. All right. Are you excited about that? I am. Your first show. <laughs> wow. And then the bug hit you at Kent State when you were in college, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, you'd been doodling since you were a kid, but then when you got to Kent State, you just really said, you know what? I want to take it to the next level. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Good for you. <laughs> Your first show in October. Oh. Ah, <laughs> progress, progress, progress. Well, this is the Juneteenth Festival. Like I said, several murals will be here. There'll be a live mural painting so you can watch artists create their art as it happens. It's a celebration huge part of down here going to be a lot of fun last year was the first year they had 10,000 people this year three different stages going to be tremendous and kudos to Lacey and Oroville nice shot there Jimmy uh, I was assuming he's right there uh, two young artists who are making it happen okay we're gonna go back to you guys in the studio all right thank you Kenny